grid direction. In Spray View, we can determine the uh, direction of the grid lines in a polygon before we go fly if we want to. So uh, to do that, I would open up, in this case, I'll open up number one. Zoom in, and as I look at those grids, here's this would be the beginning grid, number one, and that looks good, so no change required. Let's look at number two. Okay, that's not going to work. So to change grids, I click on the one, two, three, which is um, digitize. And uh, here it shows me all my points. Then I'll click on this little square here, which is grid lines. And I have options of regenerate, new grid lines, best heading, next heading, and reverse heading. Reverse heading flips the number one grid line to the other side. Same as in the gear. Let's take a look at best heading. Okay, I can go with that. And this is the number one line, so I may want it up here. So I can click on that and reverse heading. So that puts one up here and that looks good. Save it. No name change save and overwrite yes. Let's look at number three. Okay, we will digitize, left click, best heading, That looks good. I think again I will reverse heading. Perfect. Save it. Save it. Yes. Let's take a look at four. That looks good as it is. Check out number five. Um, just for fun, I could make these lines line up with this edge. So I think I'll do that. Left click on digitize. And now I'm going to use new grid lines. So when it builds the grids, it's going to make them left to right, same as in the airplane. So here's my first point with my line direction and I'm going to say yeah that's good. Yes. So let's, took, uh, let's do the same one and we'll look at uh, what happens with next side heading. So that just moves it along to line up with the edges. Here. Here. Let's, let's look at best heading. I like that. So that's how you can modify your grid lines in Spray View.